He's barely in his 20s, but a Minnesota college student has come up with the most Minnesota of ideas. Dylan Deerking has launched a business tapping into his love of lake life. And as Boyd Hoopert shows us, Dylan's venture is taking off fast. Dining out at the lake has always come with a natural boundary. Restaurants on shore and boats on the water. But the lake food gap has just been bridged. Cross Uber Eats with a jet ski and you get this. Before we go any further, let's meet the man under the food ski cap. I've always wanted to come up with an idea that people are like, wow, I wish I would have thought of that. Now, Dylan Deer King <laughs> is delivering. How's it going? On White Bear Lake, no longer an excuse oh, to boat hungry. I didn't even know that was a thing. There's that. Uh, Dylan's got your dinner. Here's some tacos. But to be out on the lake away from people and just relaxing and swimming and have the food dropped off, it's a wonderful experience. Dylan launched Food Ski earlier this year, convinced that hungry boaters would rather stay on the lake then leave it. Signs went up. Restaurants signed on. Dylan, you all set, my man? Thank you. An insulated backpack. Sending a text to the customer telling them that I'm on my way. And Dylan was in business. It was after the races. He needed no directions around the lake. WBL, White Bear Lake, and then that's the outline of the lake. Dylan grew up at the end of that dock. Then I started this. Parlayed a clothing business he started at 19. Threads for the thread. Into a full ride scholarship as a Schultz entrepreneur at University of St. Thomas, where he's still a junior living. Don't wait. Like there's no tomorrow and sensing on the horizon. Opportunity. There's the pizzas. Thank you. You bet. So, Dylan, yeah. who, who are these folks? A couple strangers I, I used to live with. <laughs> yeah, these are my parents. Hi. He's definitely a big idea guy. Great idea. He's been talking about this for a couple years. Yeah. And I just, I love that it's happening. White Bear Lake today. But plans for the St. Croix River, Lake Minnetonka, and beyond. With more jet skis and an app. Hey, how's it going there? Good, how are you doing? Good. It's a great idea. And I like yeah. the thought you expand, go to other spots. On waters he used to navigate for pleasure, Dylan now collects a delivery fee on food bills of 25%. Who doesn't want to drive a jet ski around for a living? How's it going, guys? A budding entrepreneur found the perfect combo. Ooh, it's hot. Mixing food and drink. Awesome, guys. Thanks so much. Boyd Hooper, Carol 11 News, White Bear Lake. I think Dylan's gonna do okay in life. That's just what I'm saying. And also Boyd, what a good assignment you had there. Now Dylan's delivery fee is once again, 25% of the food bill. So around 12 bucks on a $50 order, $10 minimum. You will find more details on the Food Ski website. We have created a link at care11.com. Again, tough assignment, Boyd. And I tell you <laughs> what, Ben, a lot of people wanting to be out on the lake t today throughout the weekend, really. Yeah, absolutely. It was a wonderful weekend.